Wow. Wow. Another week, another video. <laughs> What's good, YouTube? It's your boy, John Cannon. And, uh, hold up. Today, what I want to do is going to be a quick video. It's going to be a special video. Is I want to take y'all through the grind. And I want to demystif demystify the grind. Something that I've realized so much, and I don't, I don't think anybody's ever called it out or, or specified what the grind is. And people start talking about how hard they grinding out here when it comes to cutting. Like it's summertime, everybody been talking about it. Y'all know I'm, I'm cutting like 10, 15 pounds off, then I'm starting like strength training. So um, I'm about five pounds into that. But I just want to give y'all a day of what the grind is. Now, today is Sunday. I was supposed to work this whole weekend, like, like 14 hours per day. Luckily, I had to go to work for like three hours yesterday on Saturday, and I don't have to work today. It's like I'm happy, you know what I'm saying? But um, I have a day to shoot this video. It's gonna be like a five minute video. I'm gonna show you what the grind is when it comes to, um, I just woke up, played a little Fortnite. That's why I'm looking crazy. I, I gotta get ready for a second, but um, supplements, cardio, working out, just just going through the day, what the grind means. And, and demystifying it because sometimes so many people just, just hammer it. You gotta grind, dog. You gotta get it. You got it, it's it's discouraging to people for to me that's motivating. To a lot of some other people who don't have that personality type because everybody's not the same, that's like nigga, I don't wanna do that. Imagine you 400 pounds and somebody telling you, you gotta go hard, bro, every day of your life on this diet, bro. They like nigga shit, I like cupcakes. So listen, I'm about to show y'all the grind. The grind consists of three solid things throughout your day, right? And I'm about to show y'all the first one, which is gonna be for me specifically, fasted cardio. So let's get that. All right, y'all, so the first thing is gonna be cardio. I'm gonna take y'all through what I call the morning gauntlet when it comes to these supplements real quick. Uh, give me a second. Every single one of y'all, if you're doing fasted cardio or cardio at all, you need to understand the, the, the use of fat burners, what they're used for. Some people think that you just take fat burners and that's it, like, you, I, I bought fat burners, I take them, and, and, and I'm gonna just keep my, my schedule regular, and I, I should burn fat, right? Fat burners are to make you get to the fat burning zone faster. They are to assist you in burning fat. You understand what I'm saying? So, don't just wake up, take these, and go to work. Like, it's gonna, it, it has caffeine in it, there's stimulants in it, but it's, it's to wake you up and get your heart to that zone first, or faster, so that you can burn fat faster. You understand what I'm saying? So, boom, I already took this about 20 minutes ago, waited for it to kick in. This right here is the brand I recommend. Nine dollars at Walmart, 90 come in here. I take two every morning, That's 45 days for nine dollars. There are some crazy, crazy fat burners out there for 90 pills that'll, that'll cost you a hundred dollars. Okay, this will do you just fine, bro. You ain't gotta spend little to no money on fat burners. This is a green tea fat burner, got a little caffeine in it. That's really that's all you need. Drink some coffee if really if that's cheaper for you. I've been, I've been hitting some um. Bragg's apple cider vinegar, as a matter of fact, my water app. I just do it because Alyssa does it and she's like, there's benefits and I don't think there is. Fuck it. This shit. Matter of fact, if you, ain't, if you don't want to drink the apple cider vinegar, you may as well drink battery acid because that's what it feel like. Oh! Oh, hold on. Oh, it's about to go down. About to go down. About to go down. I'm fucking drinking. Right, come here, girl. Yeah, girl. Treat it like it's some sugar walls. You know what I'm saying? That's PG. Kids don't know what that is. Treat it like it's some sugar walls. You know what I'm saying? You want this. You want this in your mouth, girl. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. See, mentally, you gotta. Yeah, this the grind right here. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Oh! All right, my brother bought these, but I, 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 um, I definitely, definitely take a hold of these. This is a glucosamine for joint health. I saw Chris Jones take this a while ago when he he said his joints was hurting or something. My joints ain't never really hurt like that, other than like my elbow. But I think I just did something wrong to it. But for joint health, you can never be too safe, especially when you try and get strong. 
So, boom, glucosamine, this is just a one pill a day type thing. JR, how much does glucosamine cost? Ten dollars? Yeah, this is this ten dollars or less right here. Glucosamine, and there's there's it says two per day. There's two hundred tablets in here for ten dollars. You not that's that's a hundred days, a hundred days for you to invest in yourself. You know what I'm saying? Bam. Um, I told y'all I'm growing my hair out or whatever. So, boom, biotin for healthy hair, nails, and skin. You know what I'm saying? I just want it for the hair. It does make your nails grow like crazy. And last but not least, what I feel is one of the most important things that people just should get throughout their day if you don't get it in your diet. Boom. What's the serving size? Two gummies. Two gummies, vitamin C. Boom. It's like eight dollars. There's four carbs in the serving. We ain't talking about that though. About to get my brother that morning gauntlet. Specifically, this part. Do some of that. He about to hit cardio with me. I may show y'all a couple of stuff. <laughs> Come on. Come on. My cardio at the gym. Nah, nah. Get that apple cider vinegar up in you. That water. Go on, get that. Get that up in you. Ooh, straight to the head. Took me a second to hit it. Mm-hmm. Now it's burning insides. You want some water? Yeah. It hurt. We about to go get this cardio. I'm gonna come in, you know, decompress, take a cold shower, play some Fortnite, then I'm gonna hit it to the gym because Alyssa working today. And I'm gonna sneak the camera in because she the only one in there today. So I'm gonna sneak it past her because she be telling me not to use it. Then I'm gonna record for y'all. Today I got deadlift, so it's gonna be a good day. I'm doing 15, 12 to 15 sets, depending on how I feel on the 12th set of uh, 30 doubles. So. I'm gonna just show you my first set. And I'm taking a 30 second break in between that. And after that 30 seconds is up, do it again. Doesn't seem so hard right now. When it gets to that mid section, you gotta really push in that last set. It's the devil. So that's set one. I'll probably show y'all a couple of sets. All right, y'all. So um, it's post workout. It's post fasted high intensity interval training. But um, let me show y'all what I got. I got 280 grams of watermelon right here, and this is two scoops of a uh, isolate. Woo! It's two scoops of, of whey protein isolate, and I put five grams of creatine in it just to get my creatine in for the day. I ain't got to think about it no more. We're sitting at 55 grams of protein, zero fat, 22 carbs. This is post cardio pre-workout. So I'll see y'all at the gym. So I got caught up playing Fortnite. If you don't want to see these clips, just go to the time on the screen right now because uh, I had a good game and I just wanted to show y'all. So bye.
He's right here. He's pushing your way. Perfect one. Dang. So yeah, that was fun, wasn't it? Now let's go ahead and get back to the video. I got too caught up in Fortnite, so I'm about to show y'all what I'm eating real quick. Because I usually, I'm usually not supposed to be eating this right before the gym. But that food that I ate kind of wore off. That watermelon and protein shake kind of wore off, and I'm feeling a little weak. I don't want to go to the gym feeling weak because I'm trying to get my strength back up while I'm cutting off this excess. Okay, so I just grabbed real quick stuff. We got chicken and waffles, okay, with real syrup, and um, I got these Eggo chocolate chip waffles. Seven ounces of this uh, chicken fajitas chicken breast. No. And uh, I logged half a serving of real syrup, which is just like a little drizzle over the top. Black people, no, no. <laughs> so I'm, I'm going to show y'all what this is looking like, what I'm eating. I'm going to eat this up and then we can hit it to the gym. I lied. I said I was going to the gym, but I was. So this is what we looking like. Real syrup, huh? It's sitting right there. So just stop playing the game. Oh. This is real syrup. Got the two chocolate chip waffles. Seven ounces of chicken. You feel me? Oh, the macro. The macros for my day: 95 carbs, 12 grams of fat, 101 grams of protein. Oh, this is solid. Real solid. I'm trying to keep it below 1,800 calories. That's it. Ooh. 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 <laughs> my dad's looking hungry. He's a vegan now. Oh, no, that's a thick piece of chicken. What that mm. here, bread? Mm. Your chicken bread? Mm. That's bread. Mm. He don't know nothing about that. He don't know nothing about that meat life. All right, y'all, so this meal is um, 660 calories, uh, 54 carbs, 26 grams of fat, and 50 grams of protein. And here's what we got. I got, I got three servings of just, I made these in the, I didn't fry these. These are French fries, these are steak fries. Uh, three servings of these, eight ounces of lean turkey. I got a little sweet baby rays on there. I'm gonna put some ketchup on the fries and that's pretty much it. But I got a five, uh, nope, uh, zero calorie Mountain Dew right there. And uh, that's it, I'm about to grub. This is such a simple meal, you know what I'm saying? Such a hmm, simple good meal. And I wanted buns, but mm. fries are life. You should probably be buzzing. 
Oh. We grind. <laughs> and that's it, y'all. That's the that's the full day. And for me personally, this is where the grind starts. This is the hardest part of getting lean. Right now, at what? 1021? Is it 1021? I didn't have to work tonight. I mean I didn't have to work this weekend, so I'm not fucking tired. Um I, I went to the gym, had a good workout, chatted it up with the homies, you know what I'm saying? Took pre-workout so I'm wide awake. Finished off all of my calories. I even had I even fit in one of these. The one not not the whole pack, but one of them that's in there. Fit in one of those, you know what I'm saying? Feeling good. But I'm hungry again. But I'm hungry again. And it's like, right now, the only thing I can consume myself with is work. So I'm sitting here at the computer. I'm editing up a video. Um, um, about to edit this video. But something that I've been doing and looking into is apple cider vinegar at night on an empty stomach. Like, obviously, I've eaten today, but I feel empty. And this definitely curbs appetite, whether it's because it's so disgusting and makes you just like, ugh whatever it is whatever the case may be it definitely helps so you just gotta you just gotta you just gotta ah uh, good that in you now let me tell you what I'm gonna do. Nights like this, let me let me give y'all a few tips before I leave y'all. You see this? Boom, big old thing of water. I just sip on this while I'm playing the game, while I'm editing, while I'm doing whatever. When that's over, you get something like a zero calorie drink or this Minute Maid Just 15. I got me a jug. This may hold about two cups. I'm not counting it. I'm not stressing over this. If if I stop losing weight, it's not because of 15 calories. You feel me? So it's gonna be boom, you know, boom. Just a bunch of fluids. Make sure most of it's water, and you're gonna be good. Like you're gonna be Gucci. And this and that is this is the hardest part of the grind for me. So this is how you're gonna make it all the way through your day. Cause it's not hard to get through the beginning of the day, bro. Like it's really not. If you are motivated, the sun's up in the sky. You're on Instagram looking at people who are who are doing what you're trying to do. You're looking at people who are, are at where you are at. But at night when you start looking at cooking videos, it ain't nothing to save you. You feel me? So this is perfect. I want y'all to follow this. I want y'all to try this if y'all having problems with this, but fuck all that. At the end of the day, y'all y'all need to do is remember three things and y'all gonna be alright. And that's if you train good, eat good, and sleep good. And that's a good ass life. Bye. Your body never.